so if you're like me was just purchased an Osmo Pocket 2 combo edition or just the ordinary one and you're wondering how you can transfer your files from here to your MacBook and then let me guide you actually I put my Twitter handle but you can remove it you just need the cable and something like an adapter this one I got this from data blitz so this is the adapter it's six in one multifunctional adapter and we can actually put the SD card there in the slot there but first let me show you how to transfer it using using the adapter okay so let's put the adapter here shoot, 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 shoot. okay and then let us see that that is where this one will go. You should note that there is like a logo here. This is for transferring data. So always remember that. Okay. Insert that in. And then we will put it in the USB slot. Okay. And then let's turn this on Let's see it should show connect to computer and then you have to like it's not focusing <laughs> this one's reject and the other one is accept but you can see it so let's click this one accept see it's connected to the computer and let's check over 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 finder finder see this is your pocket a small pocket yeah that one and these are your files so you just have to copy it and let's try transferring via the SD card I'll show you how to transfer using the SD card. So let's just unplug it first. And then let's turn you off. And let's remove the SD card. Where is it? What are you? Oops. <laughs> Let's read. You just have to press it with your fingernails and then it will pop up. <laughs> there you go. Let's put you there first. And then let's put it here. Can you see the SD slot there at the bottom? And then we're gonna put it there. Oh, the doggies. Okay. And then let's check if the computer has read it. This is like the fastest way to transfer your file if you use just the SD card. See, there you go. So that's how you can transfer your files from your small pocket your map